Hi, I'm Sean Carruthers, and welcome to How Do I on Butterscotch.com. In this series, we're taking a look at the HP Touchpad. It's their new tablet. In this episode, we're going to talk about connecting your touchpad to the network. Now, when you first get your touchpad and you do the initial setup process, it will give you the option to connect to a Wi-Fi network. Now, like all the other tablets out there, the HP Touchpad uses Wi-Fi to connect to the network. There is talk of a cellular version down the road. That hasn't happened yet, and we're still waiting for confirmation from HP as to when and if that's going to be available. In the meantime, if you want to connect to the network, you'll want to connect through Wi-Fi or using Bluetooth to your smartphone. So to get to Wi-Fi, you'll go up to the top and you actually tap on the top right hand corner. You'll see one of the options in the menu that flies down is Wi-Fi. If it's not turned on yet, you can tap it to enable it. Once it's turned on, it'll take a couple seconds to scan the networks and then they'll appear in this bar as well. If they don't, you can tap on Wi-Fi preferences to go further into the menu system and get to those networks. You can scroll down this list inside the menu to find the network that you want to connect to. Tap on it and it'll take you to the Wi-Fi page to configure it. If you're connecting to a network that requires a password, a dialog will come up asking you to enter that password, and then you can sign in from there. After that, you can connect to your local network, and then you can go surfing the net. Now, if you're setting up your connectivity, you may want to set up Bluetooth to connect to your WebOS phone. To do this, you can tap on the same upper right-hand corner, and then select Bluetooth. Turn it on if it's not already on. Then you can tap on Bluetooth Preferences to get into the menu for setting up your Bluetooth options. Tap on Add Device to continue. By default, it'll look for audio devices, so if you have a stereo headset you want to connect, or you want to just use a headset to talk on the phone, you can add that here. If you want to connect your phone to it, tap on the thing that says audio, and you'll get a few other options, including WebOS phone. Then go into the Bluetooth settings on your WebOS phone and set the phone to be discoverable. It should then appear as an option for your touchpad. You can tap on it to attempt to create a connection between the two devices. A request to connect will appear on the Pre's screen, accept that, and then it'll connect the two devices. Now you do need to create a Bluetooth connection between your WebOS phone and the touchpad in order to use the touch to share feature, which we'll talk about in greater detail in an upcoming episode of this series. For other things that you can do with the touchpad, don't forget to check out the other episodes of the series, and you can see the show notes for this and all the other parts of the series at butterscotch.com.